Okay, next up, third binder with uh, Xenagos, God of Rebels on the front. Again, all beat up. These have been everywhere and uh, traded and who knows what. So let's see what's in this. So hopefully these are the Thought Seizes and hopefully more. Let's see. No, those are not the Thought Seizes. Interesting. So I, I ex expected those to be on the front page. They must be deeper into here somewhere. Um, but let's get going. We got a rattle chains. One, two, three, four. Jump start reprint for rattle chains. Shadows version 85 cents doesn't count, so it stays off the list. So interesting. There wasn't really like much modern stuff in the last two binders it was all well obviously it's modern but more pioneer newer stuff is what I mean logic not is okay but it's not gonna make it um, so are we gonna see more of that stuff in this binder because this kind of looks still newer there's definitely modern masters here Man, they're like stuffed in there mausoleum wanderer let's scan it 258 we gotta get those out of here and, um, yeah, I don't know what the rhyme or reason was for the way they did these binders. It's definitely just more of a collection of usable stuff. This was a player, deck builder, Supreme Phantom. A couple of four of those. Spirit Lord. That's pretty good. The rejection. The Spell Snare is okay. Reprinted from Dissension to Modern Masters. It's a buck. Oh, two for that. Uh, I don't think the uh, rejection is going to make the grade. No. And the dispel won't either. So this was the counterspell page. Is there anything hiding underneath there? No. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, now we're getting somewhere. Great. That's some decent stuff. Here we go. Spell Pierce. Disdainful Stroke. Friday Night Magic promo. It's a buck. Okay. Remand. Those are good for sure. So this is... We're deck building for modern now. Five of these. One, two, three, four, five. Great. And Serum Visions. Another Friday Night Magic. So person like to collect the more kind of premium versions and the foil is hard to see through the sleeve so I don't have to do it manually serum visions and this is gonna be Friday Night Magic mm, it's not a secret lair there it is wait what happened promo Get out of there. 419 for a play set of those. There we go. We're on our way again. There's another rejection. A cryptic command from Iconic Masters. I love the art on this. I actually really do like that a lot. And at 25 bucks, I like that card a lot as well. Get some of these sleeves out here. All right. Very nice. Ancestral Vision, what set is this? I'm not familiar with that. Um, JVC, Jace versus the Anthology, Dual Dex Anthology. Okay, so got just two of these. That's, a, that's not the same logo. Anthologies, Dual Dex, Jace versus Chandra, that's what this is. JVC, there we go, Ancestral Vision. And the Phantasmal Image um, is a good card. And there's just one of them there. And it's been reprinted. This is the Modern Masters first reprint. There we go. All right, we're on our way. What else do we get? We get not much. Here's Stubborn Denial and some Ops. Stubborn Denial is actually a buck each. This really was just like the blue kind of 
instant section here. Ops are only 25 cents. Thought scours are good, but they don't make the list either. Uh, we'll take them off. And a mana leak from uh, Stronghold, which is just a common, but they're good. Um, I'll scan it. Yeah, it's it's good for a common. And someone had marked search for Ascanta here. What is on the next page? Here's the black stuff. Here we go. So they did not show the damnation in the picture. So in the listing, this is the page that was shown, and it's pretty exciting. So there's more than one thought sees there, so that's great. We've got two damnations, looks like. Excellent. Ba bing, ba bing. 30 bucks times two, so those going to sleeve. More Tassigars. Why were there Tassigars in the other binder and not this one? Um, is there anything hiding underneath there? No. And was he? No, it was only 60 cents, right? So I'll just take him off there. Dismember. The 5th of November. Uh, just one. Vent deck, no. New Phyrexia, yes. There's Kalitas. There's four of these, looks like. Traitor. Look at 1521. Times four. We're getting here. We're getting there now. Throw these into a sleeve all at once. Knight of Souls Betrayal. Um, that's a good card. It's okay. <laughs> Slaughter Pack. As I like to call it, S Laughter. Time's probably well mastered. Water masters a little bit. There we go. All right, on to this page here. So we got one original thought sees in just well, near mint condition. Sure. Twenty three. Some more dismembers. Mystery booster. Nope. Masters, 2015, two of them, there they go. Surgical Extraction, two of these. 29.80, great. Now this page is paying off here. The Necromancer. Um, this is a some kind of promo. Not that one. Media promo, yeah. It's under 50 cents, so there it goes. I'll put it back in here. Death Shadow. Times four. Seven bucks each. And we've got two Theros Thought Seas. Ba bing ba bing, there we go. A couple of those, we'll throw those in the sleeve. Dark Confidant times three. Very, very, very cool. 34 bucks. Those can get sleeved as well. Now we're getting there. Inquisition of Kozlex here, this is the event deck. Which the scanner always tries to scan stuff as the event deck, but this time it tries to do the original, but there we go. There it is anyway. There we got a Mind Stone. Some Iconic Masters Mind Stones. This version, 90 cents or more. Iconic. 99 cents. Times four. There we go. The Retriever. I don't know if this one is. And they're tight when there's four of them. 75 cents, not quite. The Wellspring. Nope. Well, alright, I'll check the original. Mirrodin, 25 cents. Yes, this is taking a while. Guttural response. 
is a buck 48 times four of those and a relic again there's the event deck so let's see if it tries to do it as the event deck or something else hey it actually got it right 521 very nice and then the citadels i don't think they ever scanned for more than 50 cents or something yeah all right let's see and 15 56 cents all right, next page. So uh, let's get some surprises here. That's kind of surprising. Sure, reclamation stage. I want to say this was shown in the listing as well. I'm not sure. Game day store championship for reclamation stage is three something. Two of those. And that is some alternate art scavenging ooze. Three of these and they're foils. Come on, can you see it? Media promo, two of these, or sorry, three of them, but they're two bucks. All right, we're adding up here. Traverse the oven wall, we had found at least one before. One, two, three, four more. They're like two bucks each. World Breaker, we got a Mythic from Oath. So they're three bucks, there's four of them. Place sets are nice. Tireless tracker. One pre release and three regular. So hold on, let's see if it sees it as a pre release first. Just the regular. So there's. Oops. One more. Okay, 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 okay. So that was the three regulars. And now add tireless tracker. Uh, pre release card. But being twenty six ninety seven for the pre release tracker, that's great. So a popular commander staple uh, in the pre release version can get you a little premium there. That's great. And Malira. Oh, look at this! Like you can't see it. I'll let you wait. Malira Silvak Outcast. Uh, new Phyrexia four forty four. Got a Thraggy Poo. Cool card. Not worth as much as it used to be. Uh, and the Beast Token to go with it. But this, oh, there's more than one. Look at this. What grows? Dies the Tarmogoyf. There's a play set of Tarmogoyfs. That's awesome. So, yeah, a little bit of Nyx right there. And these are these cards are not worth what they used to be because they've now been reprinted a bunch. But they should still be a little bit. A little bit is 35 bucks for the other version. Let's see. Modern Masters 2017 times 4. 31.95 a piece. Look out, hands. It's the Tarmogoyf. I like this flavor text better. There we go. Excellent. The Hour of Promise again. We had found a couple of those. There's one, two, Three more, they were two bucks each. Ramanap. Oh my gosh, okay. Pre release. Launch party. Four of those are five bucks each. Great. Yep, pretty happy now with my purchase. At least got to break even and then some. Here we're in the red bedlam reveler. Thunderball, that's good. Reveler is a buck forty-eight times four of those. Um, let's skip some of that stuff. Dire Fleet Daredevil. Three of these. Hmm. Mm, okay. Thunder Maw, Hellkite. This big dragon. And a storm breath dragon we got. Four of those. Okay. Man. It's taking a long time. Alright, next page. We got red, we got a grim lava mancer. Is a buck something. 
Pia and Kiran. I don't think they're much. No, they've been reprinted and we'll replace them, right? Anger of the Gods, though. There are more than one. Yep, one, two, three, and four of those. The original Theros times four. Oops. Pushed the wrong button there. And uh, now the anger's down at the bottom. There we go. The Adept. Pia and Karan again. Ancient Grudges. Nothing big there. Now we're into white. Thalia. Buy a box for the Heretic Cathar. Got four of these. Very nice. Look at that Elder's Moon foil symbol there. And the scanner can't handle the foil apparently. Yeah, it's too much uh, glare. So let's take a look. Adding that manually, Thalia, Heretic. These are the buy a box promos. Being they are four ninety nine a piece. Excellent. Um, I'll put these in a sleeve. I want the foil to get messed up. Barrington, we got a Kataki. Oops, we gotta pause and fix this. All right, Kentucky Wars Mage Wage is nine sixty six. There we go. Cleric. It's like Papa Midnight, doesn't he? You guys know. Somebody out there knows. We got. Uh, looks like that's that's four of them. Rest in peace. So this card, I think, has gone up since I, when it was in standard. Yeah, it's good. Six ninety nine. Terminus, miracle card. A couple bucks. Melissa Bugler, uh, very nice. Uh, I don't think it's probably gonna be worth a whole lot though, and it's not going to scan, so I'm not gonna bother with it. We got a resto. A couple of them. Oh, it saw the wrong the second time. These are Avacyn. Selfless Spirit. Two of these. Eight ninety five. Sacrifice a creature to control again. Indestructible. That's good. Two of those. And a Fenza. So this is like the Spirits page. And buck forty seven for three of these. Worship. It's like one of the oldest cards we've found, other than a fifth edition. Looks nice. It's cool art. A couple bucks. It's an eighth edition. Doesn't matter. Not a whole lot. 224. Ooh, I hope there's a land page in this binder. Since it seems to be kind of trending older. Uh, Lingering Souls. Um, speed the game day promo or something. Nope, it's not that. It's gonna be Friday Night Magic promo. 319. Four of those. There's the good Thalia. Very nice. Ten bucks. And a rune halo. <laughs> Reprinted down to nothing. The original's still a buck. Uh, let's see. I'll check the Blessed Alliance. I'm not sure. It's okay, but it's not that great. Take it off here. Mirror and Crusader. One and one here. Another promo version. Buy a box promo, 449. Yeah, I uh, don't think I've seen that art before. I wasn't playing at that time. Mutavault, hey, that's cool. I specced into Mutavaults when Pioneer came around. This one's minty. 
Grand Prix version. 10.50. Oh, back to Planeswalkers, and there's some good ones here. Very cool. Oh my gosh, look at this. You seeing this? Not one, not two, but three Liliana of the Veils from Modern, or, uh, my Modern Masters. Sick. Beyond sick. That's great. This is our best pull right here. Three of those. Two, three. Pushes this up over 3K. And I'm just going to give these each their individual sleeve. So they're mint. Near mint, maybe. Now that I touched it. <laughs> Alright, cool. Yeah, now we're getting into the, the really interesting stuff, I think, here. Yo. Let's go. Hey, ho, let's go. Gideon Jura. Just one. Uh, M12. Does it make a difference? Not really. Buck 25. That's great. I might keep my Lilianas somewhere else other than this big stack that I'm making here. Uh, yeah, I'll put them over there for now. Gideon, Ally of Zendikar. Four of those. That's good. And a knight ally token. Is it hiding? It's hiding an emblem. That's kind of interesting. Makes sense. Making knights. Needing an emblem. Take it off. Here's another Chandra. We were missing one before. Or we, we found one before. And here's two more. And I have a hard time scanning it. So there we go. Liliana, the last hope. Great. Oh, there's more than one here. One, two, three, four of those. Beautiful. Love the art on that, too. 23 times four. Great. Uh, Ashiok. Three of these. Eugene. So seeing a little bit of play, looks like. Still pretty decent. 28. Elspeth. A couple of these. One. Two. Ten bucks each. A Johnny. This is, uh, usually you find the dual deck version. This is the pre-release version. Oh, that's really cool. I wonder how much difference there will be on that one. And can it even be scanned? Like, it's kind of a dark one. Let's take a look here. Add manually, manually a Johnny. Vengeant. Oops, not. Okay, so it's the launch party. I'm going to put on the regular shards version. Interesting. So the the launch party version is only 382. The regular non-foil would be 541. The foil version of that would be 1480. That's really interesting. So these must be pretty common. Uh, they were given away at a higher rate than the the uh, regular foils. So we got Nahiri. Four of those. And it's been reprinted apparently. This one's 272. Great. What else we got in here? We got a pithing needle and a carplusin for us. So we get into the lands maybe here. Pithing needle just got reprinted. And then uh, it still holds some value. A sin collector. Can you collect your sins. Man, he's creepy looking. Yeah, I've never seen that version. Friday Night Magic promo, only 74 cents. Got a forest. This is our Caprizen Forest. Oh my gosh, it's Commander 2016, I think. Two, three, four. 578, wow. There we go. Right back in the sleeves you go. 
turn out real nice. About to double up here. Well, not almost, not quite. Dreadvor, just one. Three bucks. And.